Pin, hitch, tractor. So you don't think too awful much about moving something like this until we're not even there yet. Until like you see how long it is. That's a that's a 72 footer. Um, it moves around a lot when you're moving it. I don't know, I get real uncomfortable backing it up and moving it when it's way up in the air because a little unevenness in the ground, which you can see right here, it's kind of at a slant. I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of at a slant. And trying to back it up to that top of that bin, there, the top of this bin, which this bin's actually funner because it's taller. So you're even higher up in the air. It's a pucker. It's what makes you do. It makes you pucker. So he wants to work on that cap right there. I don't know if you can see that. He wants to work on that cap right there. That is not supposed to be falling off and it's not supposed to be at that angle. So anyhow, we're going to work on trying to get a little bit of that put back together. We're going to use this auger soon. I think I mentioned we're going to move corn out of this corn bin and put it into this bean bin that we just emptied. Um, so we can help break up the corn. Uh, I don't know what he's doing. So we can help burst up the corn. Uh, get some airflow to that corn. I think the best way to do that, we agree, is to move it. Uh, so that's what we're going to work on this bin, this uh, this auger here a little bit today. So as you can see, this piece here decided to come untached from this piece here. So this boot actually was the last last harvest. Uh, that boot fell down uh, we threw some ratchet straps you can see there's still one right there um, but what it's supposed to do is come up and this metal clamp here holds this in place so we're going to order a new one of these but we've got to get some beans out of that little bin there and this is the auger we use to get it out so we're going to kind of temporarily bolt this up the good news is that once since this caps off, you can shoot that bearing with some grease and uh, get this kind of snug back up until we get a new boot ordered before really before this fall. Uh, this job would be pretty easy. It's four bolts on each side, so uh, not a whole lot going on here to actually make that to swap that out. So just have to find it and get it on order. Shit head was off today.
see the baby down in Scottsburg tomorrow. <clears throat> I don't think it was in there, but just probably knocked in there. Yeah, it probably was. It's probably designed to pop off if it. That's why it's got that chain on it. It's probably designed to pop off if it gets bound up. Yeah. It pops out. So it don't break, jam up your auger. And sometimes the job's not all that bad. That was, I took my watch off to shove down the hole of the top of that auger, but an hour or so to get that buttoned up. So that's a, that's a good, good little quick chore here. And that'll be it for tonight. Um, I'm gonna do a wrap up video. You have already seen it. A wrap up video of taking down the greenhouse. You gotta shut this green bit or the, the barn up and then shoot that other little clip and uh, go home and eat dinner. I think it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. So, uh, dinner night on Tuesday. Thanks guys for hanging with me today. Um, we got that job knocked out quick, so go home early i hope uh, you have a good rest of your day thanks for watching give, give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing uh subscribe to us on youtube and follow us on facebook appreciate it guys thanks see ya